what's good youtube haven't uploaded in a minute um i don't got too much to say except that i got a brand new best friend that keeps coming to my house every night or every other night so he's right behind that door right there which is the front door to my house he has never came in but i walk over here and look he's in the house he's actually inside so this is Binks. If anybody's seen Hocus Pocus, you know exactly who Binks is. It's a, a black cat in the movie. Uh, shout out to my girlfriend, because she actually introduced me to that movie. And um, yeah, this cat has been coming here every night or every other night and just sits outside the front door. I mean, I have given the cat food before, so I'm pretty sure that's the reason why he keeps returning back. Me and my girlfriend like seriously want a cat like really bad but we don't want to pay like the extra fee for the rent on top of the rent to have a pet here. Plus, you know, cats are easy to manage, kind of just feed them and clean the litter box, but I don't want to deal with the peeing and the pooping everywhere because that smell is just horrendous. I wish I could get a better angle for you guys, but I'm afraid to move my camera because he might run off. He might actually run crazy because he never really comes back here. But now he's in the house and I know you want a piece of ham, bro. I know you want a piece of ham here. I'm gonna open the door a little bit wider. Don't be scared. Okay, we got the ham. Let's see if Binks will go for the ham. Here. Don't be afraid. You can come. You can live here. See, something's holding him back. I don't know if he just doesn't trust me fully, even though I've been feeding him and taking care of him. I don't know what the deal is, but yeah. Here's the ham. I'm gonna have to clean that. Hey bro, I'll take my ham back. Don't be playing with the meat, Pause. I gave it to you for free. What you scared of now? Don't be scared now. Oh my God, chat. I said chat like I'm like, oh hell no. I know cousin just Oh yeah, you a scaredy cat. I respect it though. You can't trust strangers. You don't know me that well. You've been coming here for a cool minute, but you still don't know me that well. You know, maybe it's a sign that I need a cat. Maybe it's the universe saying like, yo, you're always gonna have a cat in your life and I'm gonna give you one. And I've always wanted a black cat. So it's like, you know, maybe it's a sign. I ain't gonna, maybe it is a sign. I ain't gonna lie. Cause like, maybe the manifestation is really coming true, but. Thanks. You ate all your hamsies? And now you're chilling on my likely a target doormat. Are you okay? What's wrong with your ear? Can I pet you? Will you finally let me pet you? He won't let me pet him. I forgot to mention that important key detail. This cat will not let me pet it. But you got me all up in the all up in your face with the camera here. But can I pet you? Watch, he's gonna run. Watch. You let me touch the back of you. I don't know if I caught that on the camera, but. Oh, what'd you say? Hey, bro, what? Hey, bro. Come back. Come back. Come back. Okay, I don't know. I love you, though, Binks. I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep making more cat content. Just everyday content. I need to be. I should have been vlogging way more. I'm so trash. Jesus Christ. I'm a strong believer in signs. I believe that the universe does give me signs. There's always some kind of sign that like points you in the right direction in life. And I low key think hi Binks, he came back into the house. Bruh. Anyway, I think that it might be a sign that, you know, I've been making more TikTok content lately. I've been streaming on Twitch a lot more lately. And um, I wanna say confidently that I think that I can do this content creation full time along with my music and take my career off and give back to my community. That's the goal. I've been doing this for a long time, not consistently, but still like in the back of my head, it's a dream. Or not a dream, it's just something that I really wanna do while I'm alive. And let me get to the point, I ramble a lot. But the point is, I think that maybe this cat could also be a sign that like, yo, you should be making more content. Cause I told myself that I was gonna make more content and I love making content on cats, video games, music, fashion, whatever the case is. So maybe it's just a sign, bro. Like you need to step it up. 
because you know how like i don't know like back in the day like you know way way back like during the ancient times i like the egyptians correct me if i'm wrong if my history is wrong but the egyptian egyptians would like worship cats or they saw cats as like a powerful deity i'm not trying to get off gear but i feel like there's somebody watching me from that bathroom You know how scary that would be if I caught that on my YouTube video? That would be crazy. But that's all for today, guys. So if anybody that's still watching this video this long in, even though it has no crazy engagement, captions, text on the screen, fast transitions, cut, editing, animation, all that good stuff. If you're still watching the video, thank you for watching. Really appreciate you. I know I have a small handful of subscribers that still like keep up to date. And then my friends that have my not notifications on. But, um, thanks for watching and uh, if you want to watch me on Twitch, I'm always on Twitch streaming. And me and Brian just dropped a brand new music video called Jumper. Under the Bleach Sun channel, just literally type in Bleach Sun. And you'll see the music video because it's really fire and it's almost at 400 views. So I'd appreciate it if you guys checked it out. But you don't have to. It's up to you. Um, peace, love, positivity. Oh my god, I can't. Peace, love, positivity. And I'll see you guys in the next video with my brand new cat, Binks.